if you're going to build a wellness practice or life, make lifetime patients, they need to be educated on why. Because when they're out in the public, you still go into the chiropractor? Why would you go to the chiropractor? Well, blah, 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 blah. We need to teach them and arm them. My wife, years ago, as I was building the practice and coming on a regular basis to Parker and desiring to build a practice so I'd feel successful and my destiny, all the things that you want, we all want. And my wife, it was like yesterday, she says, I want to refer, but she says, I just don't know what to say to people. So we started working on that, and we got it down to what I call a two-minute drill. I mean, this is why the doctors, geez, I don't get it. My CAs have been with me for years, and I don't understand. They don't refer. They don't refer usually because they don't know how. But the thing that makes us different, and wellness patients, etc., is building a practice on the vertebral subluxation. That's what makes us different. And if patients, as I've traveled... The, the most successful, and I'm not talking about necessarily the biggest. I'm talking about people that are having fun. You can feel it in their office, the energy. The patients love being there. And as you know, the patient has to buy you before they ever buy chiropractic. But almost without exception, when I go visit an office like that, they decide how they're going to practice. But if they're talking the vertebral subluxation, that's what makes us different.